Oh, welcome back to all the Marios. I'm your better role model than Wario, Talk Phoenix. I guess that's technically true. I'm Compunic. It's Wario Land 4! So, uh, since last time I did do uh, some grinding, I have those grinding videos up there. Hmm. Mad Seinstein is sleeping above the passage here for some reason. Maybe because you collected all the Mad Shinesteins. I don't know. He's He was all in various places as I was doing my grinding uh, every time I went back into this uh, center area. So huh. he's just kind of hanging around. But you can see here I got all the gold crowns on all these levels. and huh. I got uh, a bunch of coins and I got a bunch of medals. medals. Yeah. So let's go chase that cat again into the shop. Yeah, I've got 34 medals. So let's go ahead and take these large lips and uh, hopefully beat Aerodent well this time. Let's let's see how this goes. I probably should have spent more time grinding the mini games to get medals, but doing that is really boring. <laughs> like, the hot mini game is fun for a bit, but not for hours at a time. Doing it like five times in a row. Anyway, here's large lips. The shop owner gets large lips and, and kisses the boss. Wow. For massive fucking damage. Wow, yeah, that's a lot of damage. Rodents don't like Shit. to be kissed. This is going to be very easy, I, I hope. With that. Well, presumably he's in his final phase. Yeah, I guess we'll, uh, we'll see what that is. He's Fireballs! Throwing fire and he's, I think, higher up than uh, he previously was. There. Alright, pop. And dodge fire. And a pop. And a pop. And that's the whole boss. Nice. <laughs> Alright, well, I got the treasure and I'm getting all three of the treasures in the background. And let's see what this all is. I got like a, a necklace from the boss and. The treasures just sort of ascend. Am I actually going Whoa. to open them? They're all flying around into the, the sub-pyramid? Okay, we've lit up the topaz corner of the sub-pyramid border. And you're clear. We're clear! That was extremely fast. So yeah, uh, I, I guess when you have the medals, you can just plow right through the boss with no problems. Uh, let's go counterclockwise, because Wario goes counter to all things. This is the Sapphire Passage. Go to Crescent Moon Village. Check this out. It's- there's bones embedded in the walls. Was that a thing in the Topaz Passage? No. Uh, there's ghosts. There's ghosts. Apparently that's going to be the theme of Topaz. Yeah, maybe the, the- this is Sapphire. Sapphire? We just finished Topaz. Topaz was yellow. This topaz. is blue. Sapphire. Sapphire ghosts? So, uh, I, I guess, yeah, there's... Maybe that's this area. Ghosts. These guys have axes? These are like some kind of axe murderer? Haunted world. Can I actually... Okay. Something that I discovered while getting the, the gold crowns is that uh, the spear mask enemies change colors when you pow uh, ground pound on the same screen as them. And the... the you know, the, each color has its own pattern, and the harder patterned colors have, uh, dropped more money. So this is actually a necessary thing to know to get the gold crown on the tutorial stage. Because <laughs> there's just not enough money in the stage otherwise. Anyway, what's, what's, what's that in the background? What is this picture of? Is this Mad Seinstein? That's some yes. kind of... Looks kind of like him. Some kind of ancient count? Or Duke. Some stairs. Uh, ghost. Oh, that's a big ghost. Uh, he's... Ah, he's swooping down. But he doesn't seem to be doing anything. He swooped down, but didn't do anything. Ah, whoop, ah, ah. Uh, I'm not sure if I have the ability to, to kill this spiky Zeta, spiky Zed, but uh, I guess there. Uh, I can probably jump across 
much here. Yeah, I can. And just grab that diamond without having to deal with this toggle stuff over here. And, you know, there's, there's all this toggle switch stuff that is clearly trying to indicate that you should use to... The ghost stole my money! That coin that was on the ground, the ghost swiped it! Huh. Huh. Yeah. Okay, so that's, I guess, what this ghost does? Steals. And I'm pretty sure there's not actually anything for me to care about with these toggle switches now that I have them toggled, but whatever. Okay. Unless... Let's, let's try something weird. What happens if I toggle the switch while this guy is in the middle of the, the blocks? Nothing. Okay. Okay. I had to check. Eh, uh, bat. Bats turn you into a vampire. Bat. You cannot break blocks with your head while you're a bat. But it's okay, because we've got light here. And as we all know, the undead hate light. It's true. It makes uh. them alive again. Which they don't like, because that's part of being undead. Oh, I, I guess just touching that guy as a vampire killed him. That it looks like. Okay, uh, we've got this here. We can roll and accidentally hit the bat. Okay, I need to time my roll to avoid the bat. So we can smash through here. All right. Okay, that's probably like a return passage on the, the left there. It, sure. Uh, okay, and here I want to be a vampire and then dodge the candles to grab this money. And also to get up to that door, it looks like. But let's let's see what's in this. Okay, okay, up there. Be a bat. Let's be a bat. So on an easier difficulty, there's a gem up here. Hmm. But for now, it's empty, I guess. There is just nothing here. No, there is something here. Oh. Yeah, I saw the block over here, and I figured, oh, that's gonna be a return thing. Is this a door? Yes, it is. Alright, alright. Secret area. Uh, hmm. Okay. There's things going on here. I need to break that somehow. Oh, I know. Go left. Mm-hmm. Aha! Uh -huh. Can I? Okay. To toss this through. And you can just smash that like that and we get some money from there. Okay, okay. And then we'll do a dive. And uh, just slip in there and then we got our, our first, first piece. So right, some more money. Uh, so yeah, about the uh, the gold crown things. Uh, you just need to get it's the same score for every stage, it's ten thousand coins mm -hmm. is the uh, the gold crown score. And there was just, yeah, this guy that I never killed, apparently. I am dying! Should stop that. The enemies in this area are apparently place. hard for well, me there's to a ghost. deal with. Alright. Uh, hang on, stuff up here. things and yeah okay like I gotta be careful about where I kill enemies because the the ghost will try to grab the money that they drop <laughs> not that the money is super important right now I can always come back for the crown but if I get the crown now it saves me the the time of him needing to come back uh, this will be tricky just well then here things that I'm doing here. It's true. Dang it. Jim. Yeah. Ah, there was a heart in the air that I missed. Well, you can always go left. Apparently. I'm gonna kill. Ah, dang it. D 
stupid crawly passage. Dang it! Stupid ghost! Well, there's probably going to be a lot more money than I need for the crown, because that's kind of what I noticed with uh, the stage, is that, like, if there's hard-to-get money or lots of enemies or things like that, then the, the total amount of coins in the stage is more significantly more than uh, what you need for the, the score requirement. Alright. Smashing in here. Ghost. This is Wario's money! Not ghost money. Oh, hey, is that the CD? Yeah. Damn it! He stole the 500! Seems to be a passage uh, there. Yeah, I'm gonna come up here because. Di Damn it! Enemies! Nice and slow. This isn't a speed run. No, it's not. It's a nice casual thing. Can I does this like lead back to where I was? Yes it does. Okay, so I have uh, another opportunity to grab that heart that was floating. I missed it again. Oh well. Is this No okay. if you go to the right? I did ah, see a slope. yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I thought there was like a... It was clearly you roll through all of this stuff under here. So, well, let's do that. Yep, it's a It's the second gem. All right. Gem keys. And uh, what happens if we roll all the way this way? Oh, well, Another secret! It's a pipe. Ha ha ha. 